My arms are always open, your fears always rolling In the deep and you can't control it What you want, what you want, emotion My arms are always open, your fears always rolling In the deep and you can't control it what you want, what you want, emotion Is that a good thumbnail? I need to step out with no frustration I need a permanent getaway vacation 50 did it right, right, right. Well, it's been a while, <laughs> to say the least. Oh, what am I wearing these? Why am I wearing these? Guys, it's been way too long. So I just, I wanted to make this video because if I don't update you on what's been going on for like the last six months, you're gonna have no clue what my life is like because I literally have done so much and so much has changed for the better, by the way. It's just, it's nuts. So let me start where we left off. After I went to Amsterdam, I came home and celebrated Christmas with my family. And let's just start this recap off at New Year's. What's this? <laughs> and then I went back to LA and I got to spend time with Izzy before she left for college at CU Boulder, Colorado. If anyone wants this. <laughs> Penguin party pasta, that's awesome. It's that's so your wonderful. two favorite things in one. <laughs> it is. For those of you who don't know, I love pasta. And then, oh, <laughs> that's awesome. Thank you. It says happy, ha happy, happy. <laughs> Happy holiday, holla yay. And then a little while later, I ended up flying back to Kansas to get a bunch of stuff out of storage, and I stayed with Tanner for a couple days and got to see his new Lamborghini. <laughs> then I flew back to LA, got to hang out with my cousin Josh, who came to visit. We explored Malibu a little bit. Tyson came to visit as well. We hung out around Santa Monica, did some fun stuff. And then I finally got to visit Izzy. We did a bunch of fun stuff together. We explored the city. By the way, me and Izzy finally made it official. We're officially dating. Guess who's back? So we should probably update your viewers on what's going on, mm -hmm. right? We're dating. <laughs> Is that a good thumbnail? <laughs> been posting on Instagram, everybody should know by now, but YouTube does not know because I haven't posted a YouTube video. So yeah, that's official. And by the way, while I was in Boulder, I turned 21. Later on, I went to Vegas to celebrate my 21st birthday. And this was significant. This is the first time that all my friends, family, everybody was 21, old enough to go to Vegas, which is awesome. So my friend Adam came in, Josh and his girlfriend Sam, Brian and his girlfriend Summer, myself, my dad, Akil, his friend, some of our friends from Vegas. So many people came in and it was super fun. Wow. This is neat. Huh. Okay. That's neat, huh? We got an exclusive table at a club to celebrate my birthday. <laughs> we went and messed around in the desert.
right after, I went to visit Izzy again in Boulder. I came back to LA, explored Malibu with Jason. Flew back to Michigan to see my family for spring break. And then I drove to Chicago, being super sick by the way, I had the flu. Izzy met me in Chicago. We had a super fun time. It was her first time in the Midwest. Okay, well I'm a terrible vlogger YouTuber, I guess. But I'm just starting the vlog and I look obnoxious with these sunglasses on. You look so good. <laughs> Thank you, so do you. And that's why I was vlogging. And it's her spring break. Even though you're sick, it's cool. I'm sick. Thank you for making me feel loved while I'm sick. But this is our room. I think it's really cool. This is one of the cooler rooms that we've been in. There's a shower and a bathtub. We have an entire like living room couch thing over here. Oh yeah, they gave us champagne. It's in the fridge. And then, what is this called again? American Gothic? Uh, American Gothic. We have a pixelated version of American Gothic Chicago view over here, which actually looks really cool on the camera right now. You ready? For I am so ready! Okay, let's go. Yay! Alright, Izzy, this is it. <laughs> it's the first time seeing the bean. Oh, it's your first time being in Chicago. Yeah. But it's your first time seeing the bean, too. Solid or solid? I want to touch it. <laughs> okay, let's go touch it. Let's go touch it. <laughs> so, that was the bean first experience. Beanie. It was beanie. It's cool. Kind of trippy. It is really weird when yeah. you go under it. And guys, so I didn't vlog it because I was I was being dumb, but I got Izzy a promise ring. And it's a heart. Do you like it? I love it and I love fresh tangerine. Well, I love you. And I love you too. Look guys, we're riding bikes. We're really doing it. We're really doing it. We're supposed to ride in the street, but uh, we were too afraid, so. So we just hopped this thing to come and get a good picture spot because there's the city right there and the water looks freaking really cool. It's so pretty. Then I went home, went and shot guns with Adam. Let's see how this goes. Ah. I exploded that mother And then I flew first class to meet my parents after they went on a cruise without me to hang out with them a couple days in Fort Myers. All right guys, we are on our way to Fort Myers. I'm very excited, I haven't been to Florida in a while. Last time I was here, I was in the same car because it was Adam's van. Oh, really? Yeah, but it was, but it was black. You said this one was black, but it wasn't. This is gray. All right, guys. Well, I am here in Fort Myers, Florida. So far, by the way, I'm only here for less than 48 hours, which really sucks. I think it's like 44 hours, maybe. Today's the second day. I only have a couple hours left. We went to the beach yesterday. That was really cool. And I am at the hotel, and you can see the beautiful palm trees behind me. So I was flying back to Detroit with a layover in New York and my flight got rerouted to Baltimore, so I missed my flight to Detroit, and I ended up staying in New York overnight randomly. Alright guys, I'm at the Yotel, and I gotta check in. Yo, this is my favorite part, they always have this ridiculous flight. <laughs> I can't tell you how like pivotable that moment was. All right, guys. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. I literally have not been to, I haven't been to New York in three years, I think. Yeah, it's been at least three years. And wow, shout out to Izzy. I know you love New York. I wish you were here. And this hotel is super significant to me. It's this first time of like actually going to New York. And it's where my first Vine meetup happened. So, or first real one. First one was in Detroit, but this was like gigantic. Like 4,000 people came to Battery Park and shut down the streets. Yeah, that was insane. Hey, you know what? I don't, I don't, uh, I don't mind staying in New York for an extra day. Not bad, but I'm tired. For some reason, when I went to New York City, I just, I worked all day, I just grinded, I got back onto my grind, I got super excited, because I was kind of feeling down from being sick, and all of a sudden, that day forward, everything was just fantastic. <laughs> Tuesday night, stayed at my grandpa's from Tuesday to Wednesday. Oh, I'm in Detroit, about to head home to Lansing. Went home to Lansing on Wednesday, and then Thursday I rushed to the Lansing airport. Flew back to Vegas for one night. Hello. All right guys, I'm here at the MGM. And then the next day, I flew to Orange County. Ubered up to Hollywood, got my car, and drove to Coachella. All right guys, I am heading to Coachella. I am probably 
little less than two hours away. We'll see how it goes. I got to go to the Revolve Fest. All right, guys, this is it. I am at Revolve, and I'm going solo. I haven't met up with anybody yet. I just got here. I got to go to the Machino Jeremy Scott party, which apparently was one of the most exclusive events to go to. All right, guys, that is the end of that. Thank you to Revolve for having me. All right, guys, this is it. Machino party, I got the wristband. Let's go. Yo, what is going on right now? Then I went to Revolve Fest day two. to the next week I went to weekend two with my friends from Michigan Cam and Jake my old neighbors they told me to meet them randomly at Coachella sign it's iconic there it is look at that thumbnail I didn't show any of this yet this is the uh, this is the place the boys from Michigan invited me out here because they came to Coachella I had no plan again but a shout out for the invite and I ended up scalping a ticket went into the festival enjoyed like four or five hours of the last day on Sunday I guess long story short we're gonna try to work I can't talk anymore. Which was super fun. And then I went back, went to an Aeropostale event with my friend Zach. All right guys, I got my bag closed. Uh, shout out to Aeropostale again for the invite. Super cool. And Hamanshu for letting me know about it. So, the Aeropostale Beach House. The gifting suite. Yeah. The gifting suite is over, but we are checking out the rest of the house. Not sure what's to come here. Okay, that's super sick. Right, took a couple pictures. Shout out to Bella Thorne. Oh yeah. And then me and Zach went exploring in Malibu. All right, so this is the, uh, this is the end here. This is where it leads down to. It's really pretty, Zach's gonna get some B-roll. Hopefully I don't slip here. Come on, ooh. Yeah, that's a that's a rough one, but, oh, geez. Yeah, still slipping. This is beautiful. I really, I just don't understand, but regardless, look at this. Like, this is, this is nuts. This looks amazing. These shoes are really dirty, guys. All right, I'm gonna try to make it up here. Matador again, and we're gonna catch a sunset since the other day we couldn't catch one. And yeah, that leaves us right here. Now, what I didn't put into that is that I ended up moving to Venice Beach, California. This is my new apartment. I'm gonna do, you know, a little tour in the next couple of videos that I make. But yeah, that leaves us here. So you guys pretty much have all the updates. By the way, this is just a very, very brief recap of the last six months. I have over two, two and a half hours of raw footage that I'm going to be putting into a very long video. Well, actually, I'm not going to be doing it. I don't have time anymore. I've, I've hired a team to handle all of this because I just I can't do it I don't have any time so that's why I haven't been uploading and either way that's that's what's happening guys like everything has changed everything is crazy and things are picking up so fast and I hope you're ready for some crazy vlogs we have some crazy stuff coming up me and Izzy have an entire bucket list that we want to accomplish there's so many things that we need to do I mean I could I could tell you all the things here's just here's just a little uh, snippet There's a lot. We have a lot to do. It's June 24th. Izzy has about two months until she goes back to college. And we have two months to do as much fun stuff as possible. So I hope you're ready for the ride. Come along with us. I hope you're ready. This is going to be super fun. Going to start a podcast back up. It just, we're going ham. We're going ham on content. It's happening. So be ready. Stay along for the ride. Make sure you subscribe. I hope you're just as excited as I am because this is going to be super fun. I will see you in the next video. Hopefully posting very quickly after this video. And I'll update you later with a posting schedule what I'm going to do. But I'm going to get all this stuff up first. And don't expect that long video for a while. Anyway, okay, subscribe. Bye. Every day I got some flow.